This ranking is based on the play score, a standard rating that averages gamer reviews and critic reviews. Opening our top 10 PS4 racing games is Tour de France 2015. We do away with the usual cars and motorbikes and enter the world of professional bike marathons. Ride past Europe's iconic landmarks as you push and pedal your way past thousands of aspiring finishers. It's unlike any of the fast-paced games on this list. It's first and foremost a marathon simulation. You control a team of riders and you can switch between them as you please. Maneuver your team around flocks of racers and put them in the best positions. It's long and arduous and perfect for racers who want to know the effort it takes to win the Tour de France. While it's an odd choice for subject matter and a bit lacking a stylistic flair, it's a cycling enthusiast's dream with a play score of 7.54. Number 9 is Riptide GP, Renegade. From a game company that specializes in speedy aquatic competitions comes another high-octane cruise against the currents of futuristic streams. This isn't some sightseeing trip. Steer your hydrojets through cybernetic landscapes and make your way to the finish line. Execute daring exhibitions like backflips and supermans to boost your speed and beat the competition. For a game designed for the iPad, it looks good, pulling off that certain retro-futuristic atmosphere. Despite its rather gray hues, it's clean and minimalistic and offers moments of awe as planes drift across the sky. Along with a slew of different game modes, it also has multiplayer modes for local split-screen with friends or for online battles with other players. It has a play score of 7.82. Number 8 is Tron Runner. Another futuristic sci-fi racer, this time from Disney Interactive, it's a stark contrast as you dive into a world of dazzling lights and electronic music straight from the Tron universe. If you ever wanted to ride one of their awesome bikes, this is your chance to do it. Enter the Neon Void as you jump, fly, and cycle as you make your way out of Tron City. Run on walls and avoid obstacles in disc races, or reach the escape portal in the nick of time in cycle races. With its array of characters, cycles, and modes, your stay in Tron City isn't as bad as they make it out to be. It has a play score of 8.02. Number 7 is Need for Speed Rivals. Explore the two sides of the coin as you play the fugitive and the law in an exciting open world. Need for Speed Rivals has two separate storylines for society's opposing forces. Play the rebel with Zephyr, a renowned street racer famous for outrunning the long arm of the law, or sign up for the county's police department and wreck them at their own game. It's two different stories and playstyles, with the same fast and furious gameplay of the franchise. In this open world racer, fair play isn't necessary. You'll have an arsenal of traps at your disposal to throw at your unwitting opponents. Call in roadblocks, drop some spike traps, and so much more. Once you're familiar with the terrain, you might even land a few shortcuts to shorten the road to victory. And it has a play score of 8.09. Number 6 is Trackmania Turbo. Drop into a frenetic and gravity-defying formula racer that puts a modern twist on classic arcade racing. Nadeo's Trackmania combines 90s arcade aesthetics with impressive sound design and smooth visuals. Every one of its 200 tracks is riddled with urban signages fit for the country of your choosing. There's four different environments and four different gameplays. Ride the physics-defying loop-de-loops of Roller Coaster Lagoon and prepare your stunts for the rough rides around country valleys. And if you finish all tracks, you can always head to the track builder for handcrafted or randomized tracks to fill the rest of your days. There's another challenge to overcome with this innovative double driver mode where two players have to work together to steer a single race car to the finish line. But it's all made easy with its simple and intuitive controls. It has a play score of 8.19. Number 5 is Trials Fusion. Put on your helmets guys, it won't help but you're definitely gonna need it as you crash over and under and over again in the game's collection of frustratingly difficult tracks. It's a 3D world with a two-dimensional plane to let you lean forwards and backwards to reach the seemingly impossible platforms. Its level designs are well thought out, if a little daunting. It's a trial and a whole lot of errors. Crash a few dozen times and build up your skills so you can backflip onto gigantic blimps and 360 over the highest trenches. The satisfaction of mastering a track and making that final crash into victory is all so worth it in the end. Spice up the competition by beating friends in multiplayer or climbing up the leaderboards. Just don't play it around your mom. It has a play score of 8.24. Number 4 is Drive Club Bikes. We're going back to the tarmac as the Drive Club series expands their racing repertoire. Put aside your fancy four-wheelers and expose yourselves to the breakneck speeds of these two-wheeled machines. It retains the sleek and minimalist designs, adding a few reworks to fix the bugs that haunted the franchise. With a few masterful strokes, Bikes becomes a polished version, complete with exclusive additions, smoother frame rates, and an improved handling model that gives you more flexibility for those steep curves. 
there's 12 different bikes to collect and customize, each more powerful than the next. So lean against the asphalt, sneak in a few wheelies, and watch your opponents eat your dust. That's a play score of 8.26. Number 3 is Project Cars. This community-assisted masterpiece has raised the bar on realism, creating one of the most authentic motorsport simulations to date. Experts, pro racers, and thousands of racing enthusiasts came together to make a technologically advanced racing game that competes with the likes of heavyweights like Gran Turismo and Forza. Not only does it look realistic, laying a careful hand on every car, track, and wheel down to the last polygon, but it also has a dynamic environment that will affect your driving experience. In the real world, there's a lot of small aspects that seek to dampen your speed and challenge your performance like temperatures and changing weather. This game has all of them. Approved by Real Life Racers, it's probably the closest you'll ever get to real racetracks. It has a play score of 8.34. Number 2 is F1 2016. After the seemingly rushed F1 2015, our second place entry is Codemaster returning to grace and form. Live out your Formula 1 dreams and become a racing legend in a career mode that's teeming with content. Develop your car and career along with agents and your team of engineers. Whether on the track or out, it delivers unbelievable immersion packed with all the behind-the-scenes drama. There's a lot of hard decisions to make. With the last lap looming in the distance, will you finally listen to Jeff, your racing engineer, as he warns you about an imminent danger? Or will you shut him up with your voice commands and take that risky dive? It's lauded by many as one of the best Formula 1 games yet. And it probably will be for a very long time. It has a play score of 8.34. And here are the runners up before we reveal the number one. MotoGP 14. Be a real rider in this new and improved MotoGP game. Hit the track with badass legendary champions throughout all MotoGP games and race through its brand new Argentina circuit. It has a play score of 7.45. Ride. Seek the thrill of licensed motorcycles and ride through 15 unique locations from all around the world. Choose from over 100 motorbikes. Grab a friend and ride together. It has a play score of 7.44. Tabletop Racing World Tour. The pedal to the metal has shrunk. Race through realistic tracks and be a minuscule car running away from falling stones, pebbles, and cans. It has a play score of 7.37. The Crew. Although it's not the best racing game to ever hit the market, the crew still makes a damn good impression to badass vehicle racing games that reminisces the days of Need for Speed Underground. It's edgy and the United States is your playground. It has a play score of 7.36. MXGP, the official motocross video game. Race through multiple tracks and smell the burning rubber on sandy dunes. Dominate the ranks and go championships after championships. It has a play score of 7.32. You may get these games right now by clicking the links below. And our number one PS4 racing game is Dirt Rally. Wow, another Codemasters game? Not only did they make the best Formula 1 racer yet, they've also cracked the Dirt Rally formula with an amazing game to prove it. Buckle your seatbelt as you take a drive on the world's most unforgiving terrain. Ride along rain-dip valleys, snow-capped hills, and sandy deserts. But don't let the scenic landscapes and detailed vehicles deceive you. Every stage will test your skill, concentration, and patience. Along with the unforgiving cliff edges, you'll have to deal with the mechanical failures. Engines will overheat, tires will get punctured, repairs will eat into your precious time. The game is hard, you got that right. But it's one of the coolest things about it. With its hair-pullingly accurate rally races and world-famous off-road race cars, it's the best racing game on the PS4 with a play score of 8.56. Thank you to these awesome contributors from around the world who helped us translate our videos to their respective languages. If you want to take part in the growth of our What to Play community, please translate your favorite What to Play videos to your language. Simply click that More button below and select Add Translations. We publish four gaming videos every week. Don't miss any of them. Click that bell button beside subscribe, check the send me box, and save. Don't forget to like and share this video to your friends. To receive the latest play score and gaming updates, follow us on Twitter, Facebook, Instagram, and Google+.